camera number 310 of 365 is this uh, Victor from Coronet or the Coronet Victor apparently uh, made in the uh, 1960s uh, the material is uh, seems to be Bakelite construction and it seems to be aimed a little bit more advanced photographer has a number of uh, controls that uh, rather than just a, a point and shoot um, so let's just run through some of the uh, the functions or the features we have uh, our focus ring and uh, there's a scale around the side here which uh, gives us an idea of the actual distance but also a guide for like portraits it says groups um, scenes so uh, you can move that accordingly I believe the uh, the lens is a meniscus lens so there's not going to be a huge uh, amount uh, of control but it does seem to uh, to move and then we have a flash synchronization port we have two yes two shutter speeds uh, one one hundredth and uh, one see that one thirtieth and uh, we change it with this little slider and I'm not sure whether it works or not um, we'll see I suspect it uh, may not but you know never know it could uh, it could work and uh, also apertures two apertures f11 and f16 so uh, thus indicating perhaps it was a little bit beyond or a little bit further down the road than uh, than just the uh, somebody who's really interested in photography uh, we have uh, a flash port or flash uh, hot shoe a cold shoe rather uh, but our flash port synchronization port is there and then we have our shutter button which has a uh, on off or a, a locking mechanism made of uh, metal there and then our film um, advance that we wind on now what's interesting I find about this camera it has a viewfinder as well built into uh, into the camera there is the back it's a fascinating little bit of uh, history here I find personally where you have so much information which again indicates that it is aimed at uh, maybe the advanced uh, individual or advanced amateur perhaps is maybe too uh, too much to say but uh, just interesting that uh, depth of focus scale here so f aperture f11 and the distance of four foot um, then you'll get uh, three foot nine to five foot in focus so that's a very useful scale there uh, general snapshots in bright sunshine and with normal speed film excellent re results will be obtained on the settings 20 foot aperture f16 speed 1 30th so that's the point and shoot mode if you like and then uh, i do find this amusing the uh, little scale here guide to uh, help us with uh, our exposure uh, so fast color film super speed film normal speed film and then we're given uh, our f16 f11 scale bright sunshine clear sky uh, no um, strong shadows hazy sun light shadows and cloudy bright no sun no shadows so uh, I, I really do find that uh, fascinating to see that uh, someone who's actually sat down and worked those out to put our film in our camera we have to as it says slide catch in the direction of the arrows and then we take uh, the whole of the back off I don't find it easy to take off so that's good so that indicates that perhaps uh, there won't be any light leaks there we go and uh, there is, is metal in evidence here so actually I think that's probably a metal back plate and uh, there we go there's the inside so we put our film in here and then put it on the spool and advance the film on that side. There we go. Can only go back and then uh, just to lock it. There we go. Excellent. So there we go. That is the uh, Coronet Victor 127 uh, film format. And that has been camera number 310 of 365.